All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Trooper Copper Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today we're going to be talking about feeds. What are they, and how are they useful to you? Well, one of the many ways that you can find interesting stuff to view on Blue Sky is with the use of feeds. Inside of feeds, you can find things like science posting, where you can learn all about the latest, greatest things in the world of science. Although, I will admit, outside of the fun pictures of plants and crazy science facts, um, some of this is a little above my head. But, I like science, so where can we get more of that science-y goodness, uh, Larry? Well, if you click over here in the sidebar, in the feeds section, you can see a whole bunch of different feeds that people have created, that are made by different um, organizations, by different groups of people on Blue Sky, and they're full of curated information that might be the very stuff that you're looking for. So right now, I just have my discovery feed, uh, my follower feed, and the science feed, along with the fantastic art feed. This is just a bunch of people and their art that I uh, found a list for earlier, and then followed it. And I can also go through here into some other feeds that people have created. You can also edit what's in here as well to kind of pin feeds and save feeds and all that good stuff. Um, but what I want to do is I want to find new content to look at to keep me entertained. So you got options like, I do like gardening. I have a greenhouse full of plants. So that's a definite one. I do like game dev. That's basically all I ever did on Twitter. Like when I actually used Twitter a million years ago. I like art. We'll follow that art. And then, um, what else looks good? I don't really need to do posts by my mutual follows because I don't really follow a lot of people yet, but anything that might be interesting. Um, history, world history sounds good. And then, I don't know. Some of these are from like specific individuals or following a specific meme. And I'm not always down to clown with certain memes. I guess we could add the news as well. Why not? And then some more art. More art is always good. So I've got all these different feeds, and I want to look at them. So I go back over here, and like I said before, at the top of the screen, I got a bunch of different feeds that I can engage with, and I actually have to scroll through all of them. There's so many. And I go, um, oh, I can use the arrow keys to go back and forth. That's handy. Okay. Uh, we just have to be careful because apparently some of these contain adult artwork and I don't want to put that on YouTube. But yeah, you can kind of tab through here and you can see different stuff. And let's say that like, I don't know, you, you got like the weird world history thing or you've got game dev and you don't really want to view these anymore because that's where all the adult content was. You can go back to your feeds at any time. And then you can be like, well, I didn't like the game dev, so I'm going to click on this, and I'm going to unpin that. And then that'll go away. And so, can I actually remove this from my feed? Remove from my feeds by clicking the three little dots over here. And then, let's see, I wasn't really feeling um, the what's history, because I thought that was world history. I can click on that, and I can get rid of that as well. And then bing, bang, boom, that's how you can kind of curate a bunch of different sources of content or create your own content. And, uh, yeah, actually, can you make your own feed through here? I'll have to look up how you can create your feed. But for right now, this is how you find feeds, follow feeds, and the remove feeds so that you can follow all sorts of good, interesting content that is the sort of stuff that you are into. So that'll be it for this one, ladies and gentlemen. I've been your host, Larry. Oh, I guess there's also, you can click on the sidebar over here, the right-hand sidebar, to click around your different feeds as well. Uh, but yes, that's how you kind of browse through your different feeds and find new feeds for content that's interesting to you. I've been your host, Larry. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye, everybody. 
and have a good one.